Here's another example of uh, generating speed behind the puck in the same game. There's a simple breakout here, again. Rural University manages to make the pass across. There we go. Now, the big play here. It was kind of a sloppy play all the way up the ice, to be honest. Uh, pass off the stick. Uh, tough to pick up. Uh, gets gets a, it takes a solid hit, but this player right here manages to start generating speed. The defenseman had been gapped to these players, and there's the the false gap. Who were they were going slower up to the blue line than this guy was, who was generating speed behind the puck. So with that extra speed, uh, neither of these guys are going to be able to catch him, and he gets a little bit of a an easy walk in there. So that's just another example. Let's watch it one more time. A little further back. So there we go. Keep an eye on this guy behind the play. See that little acceleration there? Make sure he's going faster than the players in front of him and catching up to the play. Really, he uses that uh, that gap in front of him, that huge gap, as a, as an advantage. It's almost an unfair advantage. He has all that space to accelerate, and he does so, and he gets the shot off. All in all, a sloppy play, but it worked regardless because of the uh, false gap and the speed behind the puck.